This morning I want to talk to the guys. Look was name at DJ Avro. I want to ask guys a question this morning. Mm. Fine. You've busted your woman. Do you forgive her? Women forgive men all the time. In fact, they're used to it. It's part of your DNA. You're going to cheat. So now the shoe is on the other foot. Is it a forgivable sin? A lot of men have done that. They've forgiven their women. Of course. There is no Kenyan man who can ever forgive his wife for cheating. Of course. By the time that man, for instance, you meant a camera. Hmm? Nikitwa meskia rumors. Yeah, rumors are not fact. So he has found out. Yes. You found out your woman is cheating on you, guys. Would you forgive her? Apewe wakati ya fikirie. Sasa. Also, you need to give my man time to think. He's going to reflect. If he's going to forgive or not. Yes, give him time. I saw the double standards you guys put. Can you imagine what that guy is going through? Can you imagine what your women go through with your stupid behaviors every day? Have you ever thought of it like that? Oh, Jayoku, Jaona, your charani, Jaona, your performance. Akabaga! Nyo! Ladies, they want time to think whether to forgive you or not. You know, he has to make a decision, eh? So, what? <laughs> you never cease to amaze me. At all. First of all, he needs to recover. You need to know he needs to recover. That fellow, Ladies, are you listening to this man? That fellow, wherever he is, you know, you know how her shock is different. Eh? Your way, shock is different you can shock, from her shock. There is a way you can shock a man uh. until you kill him. Mm. He needs to be counseled. He needs to take time. <laughs> A couple and need to visit me more. I swear, ladies, you know, uh, every day I think about how you live with these men. Mm. I believe all of you need a head of state commendation. Every woman mm. in Kenya, don't be in a hurry, give him time, ladies. Give me a call and tell me what you think of what you've just had. He needs time to think whether to forgive you or not. You know, now he's recovering. Uh, yeah, them they need to recover. You, you don't. You're supposed to forgive immediately. In fact, that's where they quote the Bible. And you forgive how many times? Biblically? 70 times, 7 <laughs> times. Imagine your tunaza. <laughs> Ooh, we all 711 is my number. So you've busted her. Why is it unforgivable? If she strays, it's un... You and you stray, you say, Nikashaitani kalinigia maali. Ata ye, kashaitani yako wako, kamekingia ye maali. How is it different? Suddenly she is a harlot. She is loose. It's unforgivable. The whole society needs to know to avoid her. Not wife material. The labels you put on these women when they stray are incredible. But when you stray, Nikashaitani. You know that man is getting so many advices from so many people. He needs to compile a report. 0711-046-105 is my number. Your woman has strayed. Can you forgive her? Men expect you as ladies to forgive them every time they stray. You, can you look at your wife in the face and say, Nimekusame. Forget about the video. I want you to imagine your wife has strayed, your woman has strayed. Would you forgive her? Would you? Why is it impossible for you as a man to forgive us to a woman who has strayed? Dr. Motuli Wilson, let me just go to your tweets because oh, it's already on fire, Twitter. Saying, good morning, I can forgive her, but I can never trust her again and cheating is the last thing I can tolerate in a relationship. So, Dr. you're saying, mutaachana. For all intents and purposes, mutaachana. Hey. Simon M. Minus, and even in the Bible, a good number of men were polygamous. 
Tell me a case where a lady had more than one man. Tweeting here, they saying, I know of a neighbor whose woman cheated on him, got pregnant for another man, and he forgave the wife, and they are happy. Forgive and forget. Esther Wakamori is saying, here's the problem with our men. They think we are supernatural, that we don't have feelings. We can also mess up. And as they require our forgiveness, we also require theirs. Hey. Captain Victor, good morning, saying, women cheat as revenge. Men don't. They share love. So once you forgive, they'll do it again and again. <laughs> Be what KD, good morning. You're saying... What cheating are you talking about? Because my woman hugging another man is already cheating. <laughs> Aki. Really? Good morning, Maina. Morning to you. Salimia Kingani. I'm a Salimika. That's a hapa. Eh. You have to see you come any primary trauma or any secondary trauma. Kwadili. Me at a CSE. I can't live with it. Me have a, have a, have a known person I know, eh? Uh. The wife cheated on him. Uh. Hope they don't listen to classic 105 because uh, they got a kid. Uh -huh. yeah, that Chomoka looking like that guy, like nothing, and he's just a neighbor to the guy. Uh -huh. So I was like trying to figure out now how do I live with this? Where can I go? I'll just go. I'll just go to those. Um, uh, what do you call this? Akina Bahari in Lebanon, Akina Qatar. Let me ask you. Because I'll need the whole, uh, the whole life to, to, to recover. Ask me. So you would not forgive your woman? <laughs> what did you just say? You would not forgive your woman? For doing what? For straying. <laughs> uh, you know, I wouldn't even want to imagine. Imagine. Just not even forgive. <laughs> imagine he, he did it. Okay. Ow. Fine. You have found For out where? she has done it. Uh -huh. at, at I assume what? You, well, let's you, give another example. Can I? <laughs> let's not use my example. Me, I'm getting over emotional in this case. And, Come on, can I? Yes. You know, me, I want to ask you, I want to deal with you. So you would <laughs> not forgive her? Let me tell you, if I had a signal, not even now, getting uh, to get her like in action or red hearted like in anything, uh, eh? uh, trust you, me, that's the end of us. I don't have that part of forgiving that. No, eh, that's too big for me to handle. I'm very, I'm very serious on this one. It's a never. It's a never. Yeah. Let's go back to the Bible. Hello. Hello. When a man, go, uh, when a woman has uh, multiple partners, uh. and a partner again. You tell me. You're the she one who's quoting prostitute. the Bible, not me. She's a prostitute. Did you ever hear where somebody, uh, where, where the, the men were told because they had so many wives, they were told, they were called, some, they were called uh, heroes. We were neither sustained the 200 wives, but they were now never called prostitutes. Thank you. Okay. Me, I can go mad. What is this? Listen to all your men reason. So she has strayed. Why do men find it so hard to forgive their women, a strained woman? When you stray unasema ni kashaitani when she strays she's a harlot explain that to me bruce cheboyo maya wakabartonjo good morning saying to me no african man will ever forgive never why Dr. Mutri Wilson said, I can forgive all other, th all other sins, but cheating is too much. I'll show her the door, but not without embarrassing and exposing her to, over to her follies. And I will do this without being childish. Really? <laughs> Captain Kale is saying, a cheating woman is worse than Al-Shabaab. She's a terrorist. She's a vampire. Even Matiangi rules can't beat her. <laughs> I swear, Captain Kale. Kanka, Justin Kanga is saying, just like how polyandry is rare and illegal, so should cheating by our wives. I can share a cigarette with another man, but a wife? That's suicidal. Before we talk about me forgiving, let's stop imagining she's cheating on me. Can we start there?
putting here the interesting observation saying so a man cannot be a prostitute when having sex with many ladies but they are calling us prostitutes to see how men are selfish they are also prostitutes they cannot be heroes Or Twitter is on fire. Jackie, to have gotten your request, I'm going to look for it. Thank you very much. Doubtly more here. You're saying cheating is immoral by any standard. If someone cheats on the other, it means they don't respect them, consider them, recognize them, not ready for them. And in any case, uh, they seem to be wasting their time. If someone is not ready for marriage, let them not waste each other's space. Oh, Twitter is on fire. Where are you? Hello, good morning, Maina. Morning. Can I get a body? Mzuri sana. Maina, maali ambapo mina ya zasamee muke, niki mpata, ni kukosa kumuua peke yaki. Ni kukosa kumuua? Kukosa kumuua, iyo ndo musamaa ni tamupa. Lakini niki mbasi hivi, wakati huo huo, hata kama nilikuwa kwa shuguli muhimu na hacha, na shugulikia iyo kwanza hende. Na kienda na hakuna kesi, hakuna mambo ya kesho, oo oh, nitaenda ni haa haa Same day, wakati uo uo, hata kama nilikuwa busy kiasi gani Na wachana na ile shugule nilikuwa nayo Ya shugulikia mambo yake kwanza ya kurudi kwao Na ataenda kwao direct, hata kama ni ndega nita mtukulia hende Lakini nisimuone tena maisha ni mwangu Kwa hiyo hili kwa very sensitive, si mahali ambapo napendo utayusemo uo uchimusinde mkichezea mkichezea Ati uo ulimpata, ulimpata, ukafanya hii. Aha, hakuna kitu kama hiyo. Asante sana, Maina. Chukwe. Asante sana. Hey, hello. Morning, Maina. Morning. My name is Juma. Yes. Today I agree with you. Have you ever forgiven a string spouse? Yeah, I've forgiven. I, I, forgave my, I forgave my girlfriend when she was my girlfriend before. She once stayed with, my, with one of my friends. Uh -huh. Yeah. And you forgave her? Yeah, we fought and we separated for two weeks, but let her realize that I still love her and forgive her. And now you're married to her? We have been together for the last 14 years. And she has never strayed again? Yes, I don't know. That, that's, where I can, that's where I can't say. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you very much. Interesting. Very interesting. Hello. Hello. I'm Jambo Nzango. Hatu Jambo Bwana Gwiji Mambo Vipi Wewe. Shwari Mwambaji. Tuamba Salama. Ah, Kingangi. Mambo. Wazi Chomea Wapi. Sasa Ndo Tuambie. Sawa, mimi nika watungu na biskuti ya jinja hapa. Ah, karibu tena sana. Asanti. Mm -hmm. Sasa kazi ya kumza me, binadamu zambi ni ya nani? Ya mwenyezi mungu. Bona wanataka mini msamehe. <laughs> really? Kazi ya mwenyezi mungu, mwenyezi mungu mwenyewe ifanya ndo si mimi. <laughs> Sio wewe. Uh, uh, nitakuwa ngumu kidogo. Sasa ni kwa swali. Eh, uliza. Ile biashara nani kaiweka? Wanakoshea. Ni mwanaume kaiweka ni mwanamke. Wako partners? Hapana, mwanaume ndo ametoa fedha nyingi pale. Mm. Kumbe anamfungulia uwanja wa kugongewa penalty, sio? <laughs> Ah, kigwiji. Kwa eh. mke ukimunuli ya gari, penanti itagongwa na itaingia. Ukimunuli ya nguwe inapendeza, atagongwa penanti na itaingia. Kapagali mwenyazi mungu wafanya kazi yake, misi ito mtamehe mimi. Ok. <laughs> eh. Ayas. Na pitu tuteze matatizo, matatizo tu. Asad. <laughs> Really, Gwiji? Wait, ladies, why aren't you calling in? I need to hear from you. <laughs>